How's it going, Chip Tribe? It's me, Chips, back with another episode of a 1 billion lions versus every single Pokemon in the last episode. If you did not see it, we began this here science experiment. And uh, in this episode, we are going to continue. If you don't know all the rules, uh, they're in the description or in the last episode. Uh, and they're kind of important for this series because science thrives on the methods. So without further ado, let's go prove some people on the internet wrong. And prove just how big 1 billion is. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's beat up Wayne here. Alright. Dude, we are like... Like, not even a minute into this episode already. Already we're fighting some things. Okay. So let's, uh, let's keep on doing this. Oh, it's got Splash. See Is this guy gonna do anything against the lion? No. No. It's not every Pokemon, as I was saying. It's like 20 legendaries. Whoa! Pull out an Arceus right now. Do it. Episode 2. Let's prove him wrong. Okay. Uh, Sunkern works as well. Literally second worst Pokemon in the game at this point, actually. Second worst. That's fine. He's got Absorb. Use resistance here with a lion makes sense. Um, you throw a leaf at a lion, ain't gonna do much. Hence, fire. Resists, whatever, it makes sense. Mmm, mmm. Something else I wanted to address. Man, this guy sucks. Uh, something else I wanted to address. What was that thing I want? Oh, right, right, right. Um, so in the last episode, I mentioned, um, trying to figure out what, about what level Pokemon will, uh, these guys will evolve at. Um, because you have to remember, these, sure, they look like Litleo. They are not Litleo. These are Alliance. Um, and so normally, Litleo evolves at level 35. And I thought, that's way too late. So I did a little Googling, did a little searching, uh, and I found that uh, lions typically reach adulthood about one third of the way through their total life, uh, give or take, very general estimate, about a third. Hence, um, by the end of this, um, by the end of this series, I'm expecting we're gonna be at level like 70-ish. So I'm gonna uh, do a little. We do a little, do a little math here, uh, and say if that's the end of their life, max level, then about a third of that, I'm saying level 25. It's a little, a little more than a third. We're going with it. Level 25. These Litlia will Litlia will become Pyroars, aka these smaller lions will become a bigger lions. And that is about it. Um, so normally I would run around in this grass for a while and kill everything that I see. But as I mentioned last episode, I believe, um, we are trying to just get to the PC. So we can, uh, have access to some more of the lions in there because, uh, I don't know if you've noticed, the beginning of this game is freaking long. Also, all of these guys suck, apparently. Apparently, every single one of these guys sucks. Don't know why. Not similar strength. I don't think... Maybe it is similar strength. It's possible. I don't remember. Um, I, it, I don't think it should be. Because it should be random so anything can show up. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, and I'm a chop. I don't know what's up with this. Botanist Joey. It's definitely randomized because he's called a botanist. Also, this Machop is as tall as that child. Oh! Kick the lion. You know, scientifically? That makes sense. That makes sense. Uh, you kick a lion. I'm assuming it'll do a lot of damage. And a Yamask. Okay. Okay. Here is one of the points that everyone always brings up. They say, how is a lion 
ever gonna beat a ghost type? With their teeth. With their teeth. Just like that. Well, it's, it technically survived, but... But... Oh, uh, that's fine. Yeah, and also, what's a ghost gonna do to a lion? Hmm? Hmm? Scare it? Lions don't feel fear. Protect against it? Waste it a little bit of time? Maybe. That's a possibility. I'll give you that. I'll give you that much. But it ain't gonna work forever. Boom! Ghost dead. Science proved. Easy. Easy. Level 9. Yeah. Get wrecked, botanist Joey. Get wrecked. Alright, we got these two people. I would read their dialogue, but if you remembered in the last episode... We are here on a very, very important mission. I don't care what these guys are doing, trying to like save their universe or whatever. Child... Oh, excuse me. Child's play. Absolute child's play. We are here to prove some people on Twitter wrong, and that is a quest uh, that there's nothing more, uh, more noble. That I can think of. Nothing more noble. Later. Let me snag this item that I probably won't be able to use. And kill this guy, whatever it is. A ghastly. Can't wait to prove my point again. Let's do it again. Fight the ghost. Ghost is dead. Been a rule since Gen 2. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure Bite was in Gen 2. Not a hundred on that. It's been a rule since whenever Bite was a move. Well, and whenever Dark was a thing. You you get it. You get it. What is this? What was that like drum beat going in there? I don't know what that. Ooh, Blissey. Three experience, you say? Three experience? Alright, I'm also, I'm pretty sure that, uh, there's a thing in this game where, uh, anyone can have, like, uh, the SOS thing is still a thing and they can call anyone they want. Pretty sure that's a thing. Not a hundred. I'm sure we'll find out. Just when we get close to the town, there's like a, a, a drum beat going in. Oh, yeah. Yo, Alolan Executor. Look how much fun these guys are having. I'm going to slaughter every single one of your pets for science. Let's get it. You too, Hala. You too. No one is safe. No one is safe from the power of science. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of dialogue. A lot of dialogue. Wish there was a speed up button in this, but uh, as far as I know, there is not. So we must uh, make do. He's healing us up. Oh, he healed us. Oh, okay. So something we established last time. Everyone had a little bit of damage on them and we're not supposed to be able to heal at all. So anytime our guys get healed against our will, it counts as them all dying and getting three brand new lions. Unless the counter is up to nine. All right. So we are going to fight Hal. And, uh... He might have six Pokemon. That is a possibility. Is a very strong possibility. And we will uh, prevail nonetheless. Yeah, they're talking about Tapu Koko, that legendary Pokemon that I'm going to murder with my lions. Cannot wait. 
cannot wait. All right, moment of truth. <laughs> okay. All right, magic carp. These depth. These are definitely similar strength. Hundred percent. Or we are just getting very, very lucky. All right. We've got new Lily. New Lily. I'm pretty sure. Uh, who, which one was our starter? Yeah, we're on Norman the Fourth now. Norman the Fourth. I was gonna change his nickname in between episodes, and I forgot and didn't do it. That's uh, that's all the explanation I got. That's it. All right. Sorry about that. Uh, one of the downsides about using your phone as a webcam is that sometimes people call you and then it stops recording. But uh, Magikarp is dead. I don't know if that was a uh, that was a uh, cut out or not. Not sure. But we're gonna keep on keeping on here. We are gonna keep on keeping on. We are getting struggle bagged. It's all good. Don't know why I said it like that. I thought that was gonna sound funny in my head, and then it just came out. Came out real weird. Alright, Cricketot. We all knew Cricketot wasn't gonna be an issue. We knew. My dude, please don't have one real Pokemon and then the rest are all Cricketot. Please don't make that a thing. Please don't make that a thing. I should get to my other guys out here if we're just fighting Cricketots. I hope we're not just fighting Cricketots though. That would be demoralizing. To the uh you know, future of this this series. Ooh, bide could be a problem. Could be a problem. We might have okay. Well, it was not a problem. Never mind. Never mind. Please don't send on another Cricketot. Headbutt? Can't do that, because I'm pretty sure lines don't go around headbutting their prey. Okay, okay, we're good. We're good. I'll switch out. I'll, I'll uh, share the love a little bit. Spread it around. So uh, I think we can confirm here. 100% similar strength. Which is fine, because, you know, then we won't be pitting the baby lines against the, the Arceuses, because that's, you know... Probably not... Not the Dilio that's going to be going on here. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's right. Lines feel no love for your Pokemon kind. Yes. Yes. Charm. This is annoying. This is annoying. We'll be honest. Come on. Yes! Leo doesn't care about you, Igglybuff. I don't care what your ability says. Huh? Huh? Lions can't get infatuated. Yeah! Yeah! Okay. Okay, this is gonna take a while, but I believe in Leo. I believe in the power of the lions. Okay, well, it had to happen eventually. Dude, charm defense curl. Not my favorite combo at the moment. Come on, Leo, come on, yes. Yes, one more. One more, I'm pretty sure we're just doing one damage at this point anyway. Let's go. Let's go. Yes. Yes, Leo. Lions. Mmm. Science. Love it. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. No work up. And it's a very well. Our attack stat is through the floor. So Norman the Fourth, come on out. Uh, 
I really should uh, change his nickname. Once we get to the Pokemon Center, I will be able to. And we can keep track. I'm thinking Norman is going to be a, uh, a permanent fixture. Norman and his great lineage. But uh, we'll see. We'll figure it out. Oh. Oh. Why? What was that? Encore. I don't got a lot of different moves to do anyway. Scratch and tackle are basically the same thing. Alright, alright. You know what? You know what? Uh, I'd love to get some more experience here. But sometimes, you know, Lily's got to come in and just do the work. You know, based on my research, uh, apparently the female lions are really the ones who do most of the hunting. So this makes sense that uh, Lily is uh, slaughtering people left and right. Lily's the hunter. So let's, uh, we go. Oh, so close. Norm in the fourth level, nine level ten. Oh, ooh, Cosmog. All right, Leo, come back out. Come on back. I think Cosmog is ghost. Hey, remember last episode when I said I was gonna eat Nebby? We're doing it. Sorry, Lily. Not that sorry, though. Not that sorry. There we go. Six Pokemon, no problem. No problem. Here we go. Yeah. Look at a little executor back there. I'm gonna eat you too. I'm gonna eat you too. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Got a Z-Ring that I will literally never use. Not once will I use that. Not a single time. Uh, don't care what you have to say. Four islands! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Festivities, cutscenes. I love it as much as the next guy. Except, oh wait, no I don't. I don't care. Alright, yeah, yeah, we gotta... We gotta think. I can... I'm starting to see... What uh, what people mean? Normally, I'm like, you know what? I don't mind the slower pace of uh, Gen Seven. I don't mind stopping to smell the roses. Uh, but upon replaying it with a challenge of mine. To, oh, sorry, uh, I ate your friend, Lily. Sorry about that. Did not uh, did not mean to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, these guys are just like... This is Twitter right here. The platform of Twitter. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. No! Heal me again! That's... Oh. That is... Whoops, 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 whoops. Three more deaths! I swear, they gotta stop doing this. We're on Norman the Fifth! The Fifth Norman, I tell you. I think we're about to get to the Pokemon Center, though. Oh, no. We gotta go down to... Do we go to the Pokemon Center first? 
before going down to the lab? I'm not sure. That's right, Dr. Chips, that's me. PhD in lions. Oh my god. Stop talking and let me eat that Meowth. Not me, the lions. I would never eat a Meowth. But the lions on the other hand, I don't think there's anything they wouldn't eat. Let me go to the Pokemon Center. God. Oh. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't think this place is, yo. Oh. Lily's using repels. I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that. Mostly because I need to kill everything. So, no repels. No repels. Oh, we can pop down the ledge. Talk to the professor. Before we do that though, I want to just peep something real quick. Look at that. We have killed 15 Pokemon just in the Alolan decks. I don't know if that counts national deck stuff. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. And only 12 lions are down, so we've got the advantage. It might take less lions to beat every Pokemon than every Pokemon at this rate. Okay, okay. Dude, this building is not safe. There are holes in the wall. It's falling apart. That foundation is probably insane. Oh, he's got a basement. He's probably good. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got a basement and his house is in, like, the sand. I don't know about that. That must have been a pain to do. <coughs> oh yeah, we're getting the Rotom. Can I feed this Rotom to one of my lions? Can I do that? I feel like they never addressed the fact that Rotom can talk. This guy. That's crazy. Yeah. What's with this? Do Pokemon have like full on languages? Are they intelligent beings? Am I slaughtering an entire race of intelligent beings with lions right now? I don't know. Oh boy. Looking at the loft. This is. Oh, yeah, it can't go in our loft. Kooks is giving us the lowdown. I just want to get out of here and keep on killing some stuff. Trainer school. I actually like the trainer school. It's like a little, uh, it's like a little mini gym. When there aren't real gyms. Alright, I wonder if they count the teacher as an important trainer. Oh, darkest day. Except not, because it's the wrong game. That's weird that it's like, that's a thing in, in both of these. Like, darkness. Dark Day, Eclipse. It's interesting. Ah, uh, talking about Z-Crystals and stuff that I can't do. Okay. Let's, uh, let's battle some trainers. And then, I think, it's Pokemon Center. 
We'll see though. We'll see. Pan Cham. All right. All right. Let's uh, tackle. Let's kill this Pan Cham. Weird. Okay. Okay. We might have a slight issue here. Ooh, leering again. You blew it. You blew it, Pancham. This is another reason that uh, Lions would win, because Pokemon, canonically, in the games, not that smart. Not that smart. The AI of wild Pokemon isn't that good. Uh, Lions, on the other hand, know how to do exactly one thing, and that thing is murder. And probably some other stuff, too, but, you know. They know how to kill stuff, and they'll kill these these Pokemon if they have to. The Brava, this does. I don't know about similar strength on this guy. It's interesting. Let's try scratching it, mixing it up, changing up the animation a little bit. Okay, okay, that's kind of some decent damage. Whoop! Super effective. Okay, didn't do that much. Again, as I was saying last episode, everyone knows surefire way to beat a lion. Throw some dirt right on there. Throw it right on there. Do all these trainers normally only have one Pokemon? And I added two extra? Did I only add one extra? It's possible I only added one extra to every regular person. Cause it seems weird if every single trainer only had one dude, but... Pidgeotto! Interesting. Norman the Fifth, come on out! Come on down! Alright. Let's go for another scratch. Ooh, Gus, this might do some damage. Ah, Norman's got it. What is a gust of wind gonna do to a lion? Make its mane flow majestically? Yes, that's what it'll do. Okay, throwing some sand in my eyes. That's okay, because lions are accustomed to uh, the sandy uh, savannah. Dirt, sand, same thing. Same deal. Here we go. Let's not learn headbutt. I wish there was a way to uh, make it so it doesn't ask me to learn new moves every time, but that's okay. That's all right. Rotom, I'm not going to engage with you because I don't care. Let me. Okay, we'll fight some wild dudes. We'll fight some wild, some wild things. Oh, hey! Rotom, buddy! He's mad that I didn't uh, acknowledge him. And so he went into a fridge. And now I'm going to kill him. And just have a regular Pokedex again. Oh, this is a bulky, bulky little refrigerator here. Okay. Alright. We got ourselves a challenge. I like it. Ooh, that crit. That crit. Okay. See, now this is an issue. Because Lily is now paralyzed for the rest of her life. This is like, uh, like real. Yeah, we cannot heal. We cannot use healing items. We cannot do anything. So, uh, Lily's gonna have to make do. Snapped out, yeah, yeah. Confuse Ray. This ain't the end of Lily. But if it is, we've got a lot of lines left to go. That's all I'm saying. All I'm saying. 
land. There we go. All right. So perhaps it is time... Dude, shut up, Rotom. Oh, I can go in there. Okay. No! I don't want to talk to you, Rotom. I just killed you and you paralyzed one of my Pokemon for life. So now Leo's going to have to come out. And take care of business after fighting this child. <laughs> this is the kneecaps guy. Let's go! Kneecaps! Love this guy. Ace Trainer Scott. If that's your real name, which it isn't. Oh, I thought this was the big guy for a second. And I got excited, but no. It is a little, little crustacean. Which actually could be a bit of a problem. For our dear, dear lions. Except it's got Splash. So, it ain't much of a problem. Unless, okay, okay. We are taking some hits. We are taking some hits. All right, and an Aeron. Now this, this is a problem. I'm gonna stay in. We're about to get to a Pokemon Center. So, uh, you know, I don't wanna say if Leo goes down, he goes down. But if he goes down. You know. All right. Steel doesn't resist getting bitten anymore. So again, people, how are, how is the lion gonna beat a thing made of steel? Apparently, you can just bite it. You can just bite it a couple times and it's dead. Same with rock. This guy's uh, steel and rock. Dude, Leo is fighting. He is fighting. Oh. Oh! Come on, Leo. Come on. Come on! Oh! Leo! Leo, I believe! I believe, Leo. Oh! 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 I believe again! I believe again! Yes! How? How are you gonna beat that? A baby lion fighting tooth and nail. Tooth and nail, I say. Trying to learn headbutt, it will not learn headbutt. Clawing, scratching, tooth and nail to defeat this rock, and it prevailed. And it prevailed. That is the heart of a lion right there. The heart of a lion. And now we're gonna kill this dog. Let's do it. Dude. Leo MVP. I'm giving... Dude. After that display. After that tenacity. We're gonna, we're gonna honor Leo here. We are going to honor him. We are going to give Leo the respect that it deserves after Lily stops talking. Please don't force me to talk to Nurse Joy. Please don't ruin this for me. Yeah, yeah. Don't do it. Don't do it. Nurse Joy will be going there a lot. Probably won't be going there much because we can't use most of the things he sells. Um. Oh, is this? Is the name raider in every Pokemon Center in this these games? This guy, isn't it? Oh no. Is it? Oh, is it you? Oh no! I'm gonna have to do some uh some jacanery to figure it out. All right. So these are these were the three people that I three lines that I had uh, stored up. But what I'm going to do here before we end off this episode, Leo, Leo will not be slain by any Pokemon. No, 
he will be respectfully retired. Able to live out the rest of his days in peace and prosperity. The lion counter will still go up. We're going to grab Felicia here. Throw Felicia in there. But we will not... Uh, yeah, these guys can stay. Um, yes, we will not allow, we will not allow Leo to fall like that. Look at this. 13. That, you know what, I'm, that guy right there. Oh, you can't. Right? That guy right there. Little guy right there. That's Leo. Calling it right now. The hero himself. Leo. Thank you, my good sir. The rest of this is for you. See, now, before, before, I had a goal, but not a purpose. Now I have found my purpose. We will defeat all these Pokemon in honor of Leo and all those who have come before and will come after. Praise be unto the Lions. I will see you guys in the next episode. But, uh, if you like this episode... And you want to see what's next, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Leave a comment for uh, your favorite memory of Leo's long and prosperous career as a lion. And I'll see you all in the next episode. But until then, don't forget to take it easy.